some of you might remember that um, that Mountfield mower with a broken self-propelled mechanism it ain't the mechanism, I mean it's the handle um, so what I'm going to do is I've got this other handle here with the, the um, self-propelled handle on it because um, someone cut that one off so what I'm going to do is cut the one off the good handle and weld it onto the, the one that fits it because the handle itself don't fit the lawnmower unfortunately it fits but the cables don't fit properly so I'm just going to weld that on there um, yeah all I've got to do is find some cutting discs because I've run out bastard all cut off got them bits cut off and it's there grounded and ready to go on so that will go put pull up there and then engage the drive mechanism so yeah all good and dandy now let's, let's get welding shall we all welded on uh, so now it's just got to get them back and put it put it on the mower it's quiet in there the BM up there. Remember that video? Well, it's on. There it is. Um, it works, but uh, it's not the prettiest because I didn't didn't clean it up properly before I welded it because I couldn't be bothered to be honest with you. But um, I didn't have any cut, didn't have any grinding discs. But um, I dropped it as I was getting out of the car and he bent it. It still works, but uh, as you can see there, it's a bit bent now. It's a pain in the ass, man. That would have looked, that would have worked all right. But it does still work. Goes up to there. It's not particularly uncomfortable. So just have to uh, see how it goes like that. I have to try and bend it back, I suppose, if I'm going to sell it. But it all works, good and dandy. Now, all I've got to do is look at the petrol leaks on this one and get an air box cover for that one in there. Not bad, is it, for a day's work? That one needs a blade on it. Blade snapped off, so let's try and weld a blade on there perhaps. That one's perfect now, so is that one. That one needs some work. Let's make a video on that one. <laughs> 